Today's show, the work-life balance. Can you be an entrepreneur and be a family man at the same time? I'm Jay Adelson, and I'm the founder and chairman of Revision 3. I've built a number of companies. I've been hired as a CEO, and I've even been fired as one. For example, Equinix is a company I took public in 2000, and now has a market cap of over $4 billion. In 2008, I was incredibly honored to have been selected as one of Time Magazine's most influential people in the world. My goal is to pass on some of this knowledge to you, the budding entrepreneurs, and hopefully leave you with some words of wisdom. This episode of Ask Jay is brought to you by Netflix. Today's question comes from Dave who asks, Hi Jay, I have a great idea, or a few, um, but I also have a wife and three kids. Can you launch a successful startup while supporting a family, and if so, how? This is a great question, Dave. Um, something that I've had to deal with personally a lot uh, just in, over the years launching startups. And I will tell you, fundamentally, the answer is yes, you can do it, um, but there are some things you have to keep in mind. I guess the first set of questions are around job security. And of course, we all need to make sure that um, you know, we do what's best for our family. Uh, if your startup is well-funded, it is no different than any other job, really. Even if the, the length of time uh, that the company lasts, maybe it fails after a couple years, is relatively short, I would argue there's just as much risk in the job market taking a job anywhere. And so really from a job security standpoint, assuming that there's money funding the business, it, there, there really is no risk there. If there is um, no money funding the business, well, then maybe you have other sources of income. And if this isn't the issue, if money is not the issue, then it's really important to move on to the next issue, which is work-life balance. And that is when you're home and you're with your wife and kids, are you really there? I mean, mentally present. And this is something that if I could drive one message home to all entrepreneurs out there, this is something that takes practice and um, really could make or break a successful startup launch and uh, being a family person at the same time. For example, when Equinix was founded, my daughter Rowan was born two months before uh, the company was founded. Two months. So immediately I launch into this business. I am hyper-focused on raising capital, growing the, the company, and Equinix ended up uh, becoming quite a big, quite a big company. However, I set some boundaries uh, on myself to make sure that I came home at a reasonable hour. There's no reason why you can't create cultures that support families. Uh, and, you know, the myth of, of working till midnight and everyone has to work till midnight um, you know, is pervasive, but you can create cultures that support your needs as a family person. The other, uh, the other thing I did was, of course, make sure to include my family um, and those values as much as possible in the culture of the company so it continued to be uh, acceptable. Now, when I'd come home at night, I was a little obsessed. And even though I was sitting at the dinner table and you know, with my, my child, there's no question that I was distracted and distracted with work. And I think that just takes practice and time. In any case, I'll give you some tips and tricks on ways to balance this, the work and family life in a minute. But first, I want to thank our sponsor. Netflix streams TV shows and movies directly to your home, saving you time, money, and hassle. As a Netflix Unlimited member, you can instantly watch TV episodes and movies streaming directly to your PC, Mac, or right to your TV with your Xbox 360, PS3, or Nintendo Wii. Watch as many movies as you want, anytime you want. Cancel anytime. Get your free trial membership. Go to www.netflix.com slash askj and sign up now. Be sure to use this URL so they know we sent you. So today's homework assignment, what can you do to handle this uh, work-life balance? And I, and I really think uh, this is something everyone should do, even if you've already started a company. It doesn't have to be right at the beginning. There's basically two things. One, audit your time. Really take a hard look. Because as an entrepreneur, you, you know, you're obsessed with your idea. It's hard sometimes to pay attention to how much time you're spending on your job and how much time you're spending dedicated, really paying attention to your family. Audit your time and open a direct line of communication. Be honest and transparent with your family about that. Second thing definitely you should do 
incorporate the family values into the culture of your company from day one. When you have an employee, your first hires that have family, make sure to make accommodations for that and don't expect things that are crazy for an individual so that they can spend time with their family as well. And Once you instill those values into the whole company, you'll find that the entire experience uh, that you have as the entrepreneur with your own family will be better. Thanks again for watching. We need your questions at askj at revision3.com or follow me on Twitter at, at Jay Adelson and ask your questions there. Or a YouTube response. We love video YouTube responses. We love to eventually play those here on the show. And remember, send us anything. Send us crazy questions. Send us video questions. Send me a t-shirt with a question on it. I don't care. Just send them along. And uh, until next time, thanks a lot.